2019 is the year of the pig, and to celebrate the Chinese New Year, the Corner Pantry will host its second annual Asian pop-up on Tuesday, February 5th. Here to tell us more about this special event is the Corner Pantry's owner and executive chef, Neil Howell. Welcome back. Thank you. Yeah, thanks for having us. Happy to have you here. So why do this pop-up event? You've done it, this is your third year? This is our second, second year. year. Um, so it must have been successful last year. Exactly, it was our busiest day ever, so uh, really? we thought we'd give it a go again. And um, we enjoy it, you know, it's good for our customers and for our staff, so it's fun. And you have a passion for this sort of cuisine as well. I know that you said that you actually spent a couple of years in Hong Kong. Yeah, my dad was in the military, so when I was younger we lived there. So mm -hmm. um, I enjoy it, and uh, I worked in a couple of restaurants in New York, Asian inspired. Yes. So uh, it's not the cuisine we do all the time, but anytime I get a chance to just play around with stuff, we, we enjoy it. Well, we enjoy it as customers, mm -hmm. because I can smell it already. It smells really good. Thank you. Walk us through, I know it's the year of the pig, and that sort of has yep. inspired the menu a little bit, right? Exactly, yeah. So we already do um, our own butchery in-house, and we have a great relationship with a uh, uh, Whistle Pig Hollow Farm in Rice's Town, so we, mm -hmm. that's where we get our Local. heritage mm -hmm. pigs from. Um, so we have a great pork belly here, which is like, going to be char siu with hoisin, um, which is really delicious. We're going to serve that with steamed buns and a cucumber salad. Ah. Um, we have some really great Peking duck spring rolls. We have our little pig-shaped uh, cookies there. I want to walk through, because I want the camera to sort of get yeah. what we're got. Okay. I don't want to jump too much. So we started here. And then what is this in front? Because this looks beautiful. So this is, a, this is actually on our menu all the time. It's a chicken fried rice, which we... Really? Yeah, we can't take it off. Everybody gets crazy. Right, so, because um, it looks gorgeous. Exactly. <laughs> it's it's served with chicken skin and a fried egg on top. Uh, that's delicious. Um, scallions. Uh -huh. um, again, and this one, we have a beef rendang, which is going to be on our menu. That's the one behind here. Exactly. Okay, which and is, so how is this prepared then? This so is this, a fried... This jasmine rice, and it's uh, braised beef in coconut milk and lemongrass and lime oh. leaves. Really delicious. Okay. Chilies. Yeah. Um, then again, we have our Peking duck spring rolls. Yes. With hoisin, which is really good. Mm -hmm. um, our uh, our cookies, which we you know we put in a little pig shape there with a little bit yes. of gold dust. Yes, they're cute. They're delicious, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and they have five spice in them, so uh, they're really cool. Um, and we're going to be using you know some of the ingredients: ginger, scallions, lemongrass, cilantro. Right. You know, so yeah. And so it's just for that day, though. This it pop up. Is. Tuesday the 5th, we're okay. serving it from 11 to 5 in the afternoon. All right. Yep. And then, but this is also, I know it's the second annual Asian pop-up, but it's also the fifth anniversary for, for you guys being open, right? It, it is, yeah. Yeah, we, we'll be open five years, and uh, it's been an amazing ride, so we thought we'd just mingle it together, and uh, you guys could come down and enjoy it, yeah. Absolutely. And for people who haven't been there mm -hmm. yet, it's right on Falls Road. Uh, tell us about the cuisine that you typically have outside of this pop-up. Yeah, so, uh, you know, we're, I would say we're a modern, um, modern British-inspired restaurant. Obviously, I'm from England, so we have some dish on the menu. Really what gave it away. Exactly, <laughs> but we, you know, English food is a mix of different cuisines. So there's some Indian-inspired yep. stuff and some Asian food on the menu. So there's stuff for everybody, yeah. Stuff for everybody. I really do like that. And um, I'm trying to think, how long have you been here? Me personally? Yeah, in Baltimore. In Baltimore? I've been here since 2011. Since 2011. Since 2004. All right, so in Baltimore. So we'll, we'll, we'll claim you now. You know, uh, I know, yeah. Charm, I don't know if Charm City is a word, but I'm right. going to say that. Baltimorean. There you go. I like that, yeah. Thank you for being here. Really appreciate it. Check out this uh, pop up. It's happening Tuesday, February 5th, from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m., the second annual. Don't miss it because you have to wait till next year. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> And um, we'll be right back with more Midday Maryland right after this. Stay tuned.